Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. For today's video is about Dong Tao. Dong Tao Chicken Vietnamese, GNG2, also called Dragon Chicken, is a rare Vietnamese chicken breed with enlarged feet that originates from the village NG2 in Khe Chung ICHU district near Hanoi. Dong Tao chickens are valued as a delicacy in Vietnam, and they were once bred exclusively to be served to the royal family and mandarins. They are difficult to breed as their large legs make hatching difficult, and they are also sensitive to changes in temperature. Hens often break the eggs with their bulky legs, so eggs are usually kept in an incubator. It takes 8 months to 1 year until the chickens are ready for slaughtering at 3 to 5 kilograms of weight, although the males can reach 6 kilograms, while its meat may be priced 350,000 minus 400,000 VND per kilogram. Despite their popularity, Dong Tao chickens are incredibly rare. They are susceptible to changes in climate and require more care compared to most other chicken breeds. Their slow growth rate also contributes to their high price. Dong Tao chickens are believed to bring good luck and wealth to their owners. At one point, they were only bred to serve meat for the royal families and officials. Today, demand for Dong Tao chicken in Vietnam has risen sharply. That demand comes from a growing number of wealthy people in one of Asia's fastest growing economies. The demand for Dong Tao chicken is also fueled by its rich taste. A Dong Tao chicken has its best taste at the age of 13 to 15 months. When steamed, the skin will be crispy with a fragrant aroma of its own and a sweeter meat compared to other normal chicken. Their large legs make it difficult for them to hatch from their eggs. Sometimes, they can accidentally break their eggs. It takes about a year to raise a Dong Tao chicken, compared to three months for other kinds. The chickens are now also raised beyond the village of Dong Tao. That means more people may have the chance to buy a Dong Tao chicken. But Fan Van Hu, a Dong Tao agriculture official, said chickens raised in the village and fed with its native rice and corn have the best taste. 